like overtime could be extra earning for the sake of discussion i'm choosing procurement and internal control and while we're at it by the way you see there's a fast app they call it allowed organizational type that means any of these nodes can be available or be included in that hierarchy that we would like to add in here whereas some of them that must have only legal entity as soon as we add another node you cannot use it as a hierarchy it's not going to be even been shown or on the project for example it says legal entity or business unit look nothing i have no organizational hierarchy that has only either legal entity or business unit but look if i go back to the procurement internal control i can add any of the following because they have almost any of these nodes in them i'm going to choose cos retailers here and click ok now we go ahead and assign the purpose for this organizational hierarchy and we have already published it let's wrap up our conversation and see the whole purpose in regard to the hierarchy and even though i have not set up the finance at all and supply chain but i can set up the policy let's go to the procurement and sourcing and under procurement and sourcing there's a section called policies and here called purchasing policies these are all shared master data across legal entities 